Since the announcement of Far Cry 5, everybody from social justice warriors to Bible-thumping rednecks and everybody in between has had some kind of different scenario that they think this game is going to be. These are the reasons why they're all wrong. All right, reason number one. They don't know anything about the game yet. No. Nobody knows anything. Like, I mean, we know, we know a, a little, little bit. We know okay. a little bit. We a know little a little bit. bit. A little bit. We know that the bad uh, antagonists are um, a cult. I've heard a lot of people saying that they're militia. I don't, I'm don't. i not going to call them that because that sounds fucking retarded to me. Yeah. Should be a cult. Uh, it, Mafia and, cult. And there, there's people there's people that are mad because they're part of a militia and they think that they're depicting them as bad people. Yeah. If your militia is doing this cultish shit, then they're not good and they probably should be bad guys in a Most game. most militias aren't like that though. Most militias are, uh, you know, yeah, you're you're, you're just your st- non-active standing military or yeah. or civilians who have, you know, who have trained and are on standby in case something goes down. God forbid that ever happened, doubt it. But it's there, and people do that. But yeah, nothing more than a cult. Yeah, yeah. There, it's it's a cult, and you are a uh, deputy sheriff, and you're you got it out for these. Yeah, whatever cult, cult people. You you end up you end up at odds with this with this cult for whatever reason they haven't explained yet, they haven't shown that yet. Um, you know, and, and it's just chaos ensues from there. Yeah, um, it's, it's set in Montana. Uh, 90, I think it's like 92% of Montana is, is white people. No, oh, yeah. So yeah. there you go again. What are you going to set the, in, because of the setting, the characters mostly have to be white and then that pisses the social justice warriors off. I, I've even, I've seen some comments that, um, just from the, the picture alone, that Ubisoft put out, you know, with them like the Last Supper type setting, yeah, and yeah, had all the yeah. the bad guys there. Uh, it wasn't um, diverse enough, and of course, anybody would say that. I get that, yeah, because it's that so, time. Yeah. Uh, it's just, but, we're in that day and age. But, but then they release the trailers. One of the good guys is a black preacher. Yeah. So why would you be mad? You would think they'd be happy as no, fuck. It's not good enough. You know what I mean? No, it's not good enough. It's you only one. I mean? It's one guy. And yeah, he, he's not a main character now. It's that's you got Lincoln. Crazy. You got Lincoln Clay in, in Mafia Three, in Louisiana. Yeah, in the sixties, but you know now, depending on what year this is, it's probably recent or yeah, modern. Current. It's pretty current. Uh, you know, that, but that's that's not good enough. It's he's but you know black people back to main you know supporting characters. Here's the thing. This kind of setting is not shown all that often that I can remember. No, this kind of setting is, and 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 I would do this for any game for any reason, depending on the setting. If if it's if it's an Italian mafia, like an original Sicilian mafia style game, I don't want a lot of people who are not Sicilian mafia in the story. Yeah, I, it just doesn't make sense. Same way with same way with you know if it was a Haitian. You know, yeah. or if it's a Haitian game or an all black game or what, I don't care. If that's the case, why would you force something that doesn't belong and, or, you know, something that wouldn't be hist, especially if it's a historical event or based off of yeah. historical events? Why would you want it historically accurate? It's no different than this recent Call of Duty, um, controversy where there's going to be women in the multiplayer. Um, it's, that's fine because it's just a game, but at the same time, it's not historically accurate. So it's perfectly reasonable for people to be mad about it because well, there, that is forced. Well, there was, uh, in my opinion, there was one squadron of, of, uh, female soldiers yeah. in world, yeah. in world war one. Yeah. So, I mean, it's real. it would be realistic to have 15 women in the whole entire game. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like that's that would be reasonable. Yeah, but that's not what they want. No, but that's not, and that's not something. That's not what they. But there want. wasn't, they you know, there wasn't women in Normandy. No, you know what I mean? Like that's what I'm saying is when you're when you're reliving certain things, multiplayer. I don't give a shit, but you definitely don't want to throw a bunch of people who weren't there in the story mode. And we haven't seen the story mode yet. We won't say. And I'm sure there won't be anyway, but. Oh, there might be now. But there might be. I don't know. The thing is, is I wouldn't put it past anybody because 
that's just the way we are now. That's yeah. the way it is. You're going to force shit in there because you're worried and about you're somebody. Get, and then you're going to have more that. people mad. See, that's the the problem, especially like with this Far Cry Five. Their their main fan base is not. They don't care. Like, none of this that is a controversy. It's a non-controversy to their fan base. Yeah, to us. But it's, it's not, there's, it's really people, there's people that's not going to play this game. They didn't play any of the other Far Cries. No. But they're going to bitch about it anyway, and then they're going to change something here and there to yeah. please them. And it's not going to help them out because their fan base, then that's going to piss them the off. The social justice warriors are going to basically piss and moan no matter what for yeah, any so for any even, reason whatsoever. Why even try? Why right. even try to satisfy? And, and, well, and that's kind of my whole my whole point. I don't I don't really think we should, and we will continue because they think that it's necessary still. Yeah. Um. They just haven't learned that yet. It's not because they're gonna bitch and complain no matter what. This setting is is the way it's supposed to be, and you're going to fight a bunch of white people. Yeah. And these are sh- and I don't understand why they're so pissed anyway because they're they're racist. They're probably racist religion, and we don't know if they're racist. We haven't. Play no, the game, knows. but but you know, assuming they're any kind of religious zealot or cult, they're they're racist, they're white. This would be the for the social justice warriors. I'm surprised they don't want to fucking play it to kill them. Yeah, because that's just how you know you're you, you're you're so against white people. I don't understand what the problem is, but you're either. but you're willing to. That's the thing. They're just wanting to be angry. They're wanting to bitch about whatever, whenever, and that it does not matter. And then you've and then you've got all the way we talked about it. We got all the way over here on this right side. I would right side. We'll say yeah. We'll say the right side. Conservative Christian people who are freaking the fuck out because this paints Christianity supposedly in a bad light. Yeah. Also wrong. Very. Now, wrong. I don't see how you could watch any of those trailers and get. Uh, Christianity out because of it's not uh, Christianity. No, it's not painting them in a bad light because it's not Christian. There's They're not a Christian. The, the these only, are the psychos. Only cross, the only crosses I seen was on the church of the black guy. Yeah, and he was being attacked by the cult. Yeah, like you can just put two and two together. Like if you had common sense. You would just put two and two together and say, "Oh, they're not Christians. They're just a cult." Yeah, and I think I, I think even Alex Jones, which just doesn't surprise me at all, but he created some. He had some kind of story, or Infowars had some kind of story. Uh, <laughs> ah! um, he had some kind of story or article uh, about this was the this was the liberal propaganda. This was liberals who are making this game, who are trying to attack. Uh, conservative white Christian people and make them look bad, paint them in a bad light. Very wrong. Very wrong. Wrong. That Alex Jones, that is very news. wrong news. That is very that wrong. Is very, very, news. very, very. That's <laughs> that's not even a thing. No. Uh, not in video. Not in this. This no. is it, this is just. Okay. This, this is the same. It's made by the same exact studio that made Far Cry Four. Exactly. Uh, it's made by the same exact studio that made Far Cry Three. And they're not any strangers. They're not strangers to controversy anyway. No. And it's just now that the roles are reversed. See, the thing is, they complained about killing brown people in the last ones. Now we're complaining about killing, or we're not. You're not complaining about killing white people. We're complaining about too much white people. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> in Montana. Yeah. In Montana. We can't. Can we Not, not like just ninety two? Have... Even if it's just ninety, drop the two. Even if it's just ninety percent of the population. Yeah. Exactly. It's you're you're you got to strive to be even in a, a a fantasy setting. You got to strive to be somewhat realistic. Yeah, exactly. And that's realistic. If you're going to go to <laughs> Montana, hell, small areas in Missouri, that you know they're predominantly white. Yeah, that's just the way if it you, is. It yeah, doesn't mean exactly. it doesn't mean anybody's racist or anything. It's just the way it is. If you're going to stick a setting in a certain area of the United States. That's what you're gonna find. You're not gonna go to a suburb, you know. You're not gonna you're not gonna have some kind of game in the suburb and and you know it be predominantly black. No, because that's just you, not a no, thing. You're not gonna you're not gonna have a, a game set in Harlem and have all white characters. Exactly, exactly. And why would you want? I don't want. Here's the thing: people would be absolutely. And, and I know people. Are, we just said people are pissed about everything, anything, all the time. But can you imagine the outrage? 
if a white protagonist main character in a video game was thrust into a story setting full of black people. The black community, or not even just, like, everyone would flip their shit. It, it would be more white people than black people complaining. Oh, I'm sure it would be. I'm sure it would be. But somebody would flip their shit. Guarantee it. Well, white, well, social justice warriors pretty much are white people. Yeah. They're white young yeah. kids that don't know anything about anything. They just want to bitch. Yeah. They, they have, they have some kind of white or apology. Old, or old hippies. Yeah, they're, they're white apologists and, and that's just the way it is. But this is a non-controversy. Yeah. To anybody not. that fucking matters, it's a non-controversy. Yeah, to the fan base of Far Cry. Yeah, it's nothing. It's not a big deal. This is going to probably be a very, very good game. I hope so. And it it's probably go- and the story looks like it might be interesting, and it's something that we can relate to because we don't know cultists, but we we know rednecks, and yeah. we and you know we know meth heads, and we know that we know the farm life, we know the country life, we know all that. So it's something that I think is a cool thing. Yeah. Just you know, here and there is not a bad thing to have. It's something yeah. new. We're, at least we're not on the fucking island somewhere. We're not on a tropical island. We're not in the middle of the desert yeah. somewhere. We're not in the middle of the jungle. We're right here in good old America. And I think a lot of that some people are just used to. Yeah. You're not used to it. Maybe that's what it is. I don't know. But the point of all this is people are just going to be going to bitch no matter what. I think people more than anything just want to be angry. Mm, that's that's yeah. it. They just want to be angry. They love. They love it. Every day you can get on your favorite thing on Facebook and go to the comment section and somebody that doesn't like that thing will be in there bitching about that thing. Yeah. That just goes to show you that everybody just wants to be mad about something. They don't care what it is. No, no. They're just there to bitch. No, that's why we felt like making this because there is no controversy. No. Whatsoever. And I'm no. sure there and I'm sure we got off point. We we were going to make two, we we're going to have two or three or four actually good reasons uh and we just Go off track because that's what we do, but the point get of all of the, that get mad about it. Uh, the point of all of this is though there is no controversy, absolute nonsense. Nope, absolute nonsense. 